Hey, not gonna waste anyone's time. This is how to unlock the Mikola's Halic Tree secret area in Elden Ring. First thing you need to have is the Consecrated Snowfields unlocked. If you don't have this area open, you need to first build the secret medallion and then come back here. But assuming you've done that, you can go to this old liturgical town and then come all the way to the backside behind this building and there's gonna be an ever jail that you can go ahead and enter. Now, I was gonna speed up the footage, but I think the easiest way to do this is if you just watch this in normal speed and follow along in your game if you're trying to unlock this. I was going to speed up this bit, and if in the future you guys would like that better, then definitely let me know. But this is going to be just the route that you can literally follow step by step as the video is playing, if you're playing along yourself. And the only thing you need to be concerned about in this entire situation is there is an invisible assassin that's chasing you around the town. You can hear him. Uh, occasionally, he'll swing a weapon. You can tell where he is. But he shouldn't be too big of an issue. If you have any items that can give you passive healing or something like that, it's going to be recommended but definitely not necessary but he's still nothing to scoff at so your second one is going to be once you climb this ladder you're going to need to climb one more and you might want to be a little careful here it's easy to accidentally bump yourself off when you know trying to actually get up on this platform and with the assassin chasing you you definitely might make a mistake but your second tower or your second uh statue is going to be up here drop down to the left and this is the only bit i'm going to recommend that you you know actually play some defense on it's a, it's tricky up here uh but you're going to need to cross these buildings with these archers shooting at you the only one you really need to worry about is this one right up front i would definitely kill this before you go and board the ladder otherwise you're in pretty big danger of getting shot down so assuming you kill this one then you can climb the ladder that's you know just behind that archer and then your third statue is going to be up there So go ahead and light that one up, and then your fourth and final one is actually the easiest. If you've made it to this point, you're through all the difficult stuff. It's literally the easiest one now. So go ahead and drop down, and then we're actually going to go outside of the city gate, and then by this point, the assassin really shouldn't be able to follow you. I've never had any issues with him catching me out here. This is like the home stretch. If you've made it this far, you're good. So you come all the way around to the back, and then the ladder you're looking for should be lit up by this blue torch, and that is the clearest indicator you got the right one. One. So go ahead and climb that ladder. And as you climb this last ladder, you're going to see your fourth and final statue at the top. Same procedure as before, light the flame, and then you're good to go. If done successfully, it should say that a seal was broken in town. Then you can head up the stairs just behind where the Everjail was, and there you go. The portal that will take you to Mikola's Halig Tree. Thank you for watching. I'll see you guys soon.